So hello everybody and welcome back or welcome to the Outback UK. I'm out again today in search for trout. Um, I'm going to try this little um, run off. The beck runs into this little spot. I'm going to try here for about 20 minutes and then I'm going to move up the beck um, to some spots that I already know and love. But then I'm going to go the opposite way and go down um, and see if we can find somewhere new. Um, so I'll get the GoPro mounted straight away. We'll get a couple of lures chucked out and uh, Hopefully catch a fish in the next minute or two, so let's get straight to it. Peace! So, first things first, I've actually just had to trim this worm down a little bit. It had this extra section on it, but it's a little bit too big. Um, they'll, they'll just nip at the back, so I've trimmed it down just a little tiny bit. Um, it seems to work well. It's the same that I was using the other day. It seems to work really quite well. So, let's get to it. Alright, let's give first couple of casts around here, see if there's out biting. Oh, just had a knock then. There we go. Oh no, got off. Couple of small hits. Just saw my load darting from left to right. Put a cast down here. Oh, there we one. Just missed that one, that seemed like an alright one as well. Let's try down there again. Looks like an alright sized fish. I don't know how predatory these fish are, if they'll take smaller fish or not, I'd imagine so. There we go. There's one. Full of energy. Right, let me just get in there. Full of energy, this little fish here. We're getting in net and unhooked really quick. So unfortunately this little guy caused himself a little bit of mischief inside the net. He uh, managed to get a little bit tangled in the hooks, so I didn't really get a photo or a video with him. Um, the camera was still rolling, that's why you can see the release now, but just thought I'd let you know why. No one seems to be getting their attention as much today. I think they still might be interested in the worm. But yeah, I've been trying a few things. I tried that little uh, Salmo Minot caught one on that, but unfortunately, I couldn't really get a picture because the unhooking were a bit difficult. In the top section of my net, it goes to really, really fine rubber mesh and the hooks got stuck in there. So I had the camera already rolling, so I just let the fish go and um, didn't get a photo, which I was kind of gutted about because it was super pretty fish, but sometimes it's just not what you can do. Had a little bite then again. Yeah, sometimes there's just nothing you can really do about it. You just got to deal with it. So, it is unfortunate, but like I say, this ain't the only spot that we're going to today, so should still be able to get a few more. Oops, just had a little hit then. There we go. There's a little one. Super tiny one. Come on, let's get this guy in. We'll wet his hand. Let him just do his thing. Hands wet. Come on, little dude, you're all right. Let's get him all unhooked, wrapped the line around himself a little bit there. Come on, oh, you're all right.
unfortunately um, that beck were a no-go it was too shallow and there weren't really any deep holding pools and um, plus it went straight through a council estate and they were just filth um, tires bikes shopping carts just pure filth um, so I've come back to the original beck now um, there's a little holding pool here I'm gonna see if I can get maybe one or two out of here and move up we should be able to make it happen today um, also if the audio is a little bit funny I've lost my microphone wire somewhere um, I, I don't know where, it's just unfortunate, but yeah, I've, my microphone wire's lost, so my mic's in my bag, so I'm running on internal audio. But I don't think it's that bad on my phone, so we'll see how we get on. Let's get straight to casting anyway and try and catch some more, uh, B, try and catch some more trout. I'm actually super gutted about my microphone wire. But hopefully the audio is not going to be too bad. Some just looked at it then. Hopefully there's gonna be some trout that are willing to bite here. We'll see. Keep it down deep. Yep, there's a little one. Super tiny one, just hit it. Really small though. See if there's any bigger. Good sign though. But yeah, unfortunately with it not being bright today, they're not really taking off at surface, so they're not, oh, there's a big one. Go on, go on. Yeah, oh, okay. There's quite a couple down there. They want it right on bottom. Oh, there's one, just hit, there we go. Oh, they're hitting it like crazy. I don't know if you guys will be able to see this. Oh, my camera's pointed in the right place. They're hitting it like crazy, they're just, not seem to be hooking up but they are just sat right on the bottom they're liking a really oh there's a decent one another little hit then there is a big one down here they're liking a really slow presentation as well just right on bottom go on go on oh they're still interested which is pretty interesting but yeah want it right on bottom oh had one then come on you can do it there we go oh oh that's frustrating that may have been why i was struggling earlier because they're wanting it right on bottom oh another little bite oh come on <laughs> i'm gonna cry Getting Mick taken out of me here. Yeah? Go on, go on. I reckon there's a possibility for some trout here. If I don't get stuck on a plank of wood. It looks quite deep as well. Oh, no, I don't. That's a good start. Came off, came off. Didn't disturb water either, so it should be good to go again. Oh, I'm sick of rubbish. But honestly, people are pure tramps. All right, there we go. Oh, there's something there, something down there. Yes, get in, come on. Might actually have an opportunity today. Yes, oh, it's aggressive. Come on. I'm on a stick. It's a good little pool. Just loads of debris in there. There's a hungry little trout down there though. Watch him not even be little, watch him be huge. Yes, we got him. Got him. Let's get down here. Come over here. Oh, he's got a right little fight in him. Oh, don't, don't go under there. All right, I'll come down to the bank here and wet my hand a bit. Oh, he's a lovely fish as well. 
Let's let him go. Such a pretty little fish. Whenever you're ready, mate. Go on. There he goes. What a cool little fish that was. I'm at the first spotting video now, and I'm back down with the uh, Old Faithful Crazy Fish Nimble. I haven't put this on in so long. Oh. Don't know why. Just got biggest trout of the day here. Okay, should have had this on quite a bit ago. Wonder how big it is. Let me get my net real quick. It's a really nice trout. A really good little fight on him as well. So I'm gonna just get him in and leave him in the water for a second or two. And I'm gonna set my camera up. God, it's a really, really good fish. Not really good, it's just got really good drag. Really pretty fish as well. Try to get him in. Here we go. Alright, let me get my net handle sorted. Didn't like that. Come on, come on. There we go, he's in the net. Let's have a little look at him. Chunky little bugger. There we go. Really lovely little fish that. We'll get a release on him now anyway, he's gonna kick. Just get a little video at release on him. One last look at him. There we go. Now let's get him for a quick release. We'll wait for him to be ready. There he goes. Lovely slow swim away. So that is it for today's video. Um, had a couple of nice fish. Um, not Nothing major. Uh, missed quite a fair few, but we've had some really pretty fish as well in that. Uh, well, those few that I've just caught now. Um, but that is it for today. So if you have liked the video, leave me a thumbs up, leave me a comment down below. Consider subscribing and uh, I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.